Hey there guys, my name is Chris and welcome to my house, or as I call it, houseplant therapy. If you like fish tanks and houseplants and nature in general and cool projects, chances are you're gonna love this channel. So please take a second to subscribe. In today's video, I wanna talk about the dwarf umbrella plant and why your plant is probably losing leaves. This is a very common issue with this plant and someone actually just sent me a message and I just got done doing a series on the dwarf umbrella plant. So let's talk about the four reasons why your dwarf umbrella plant could be losing leaves and maybe looking a little sickly. So our dwarf umbrella plant is in the porch here and this is kind of like our higher lighting plants because the dwarf umbrella plant loves light. So the number one reason why your dwarf umbrella plant is losing leaves is chances are it's not getting enough sunlight. And I know a lot of the guides say that this plant can withstand low light and that's very true. But this plant is, is a tree. A lot of resources online actually label this thing as a tree. And especially the variegated ones, uh, these ones need more lighting. And a lot of people buy these because they're more popular and they actually need more light than just the green ones. And a lot of times, if your plant is variegated and you start noticing a lot of the leaves are just straight green, chances are that it's reverting back to just like its normal its normal green version like see this is a new leaf right here completely green that's kind of, that's the plant kind of telling you that it's not getting enough sunlight so i know this kind of sucks to hear that your plant's not getting enough sunlight because it's it's a struggle and you're like well, where the heck do i put it i don't want to move it the plant's got to transition to a new spot it's annoying i know but it's probably the number one reason it's losing leaves and don't worry we're losing leaves here too the second reason your dwarf umbrella plant is losing leaves is just because it's naturally just kind of shedding off some dead leaves. And chances are, especially like when, if you're moving this plant and it's freshly just brought into its new location, like maybe if you just bought it and you put it in a place in your household, uh, it could take a couple months for this plant to kind of get used to this, like the location you put it in. And um, this plant is kind of, uh, how do you say it, um, emotional about moving it. You know, a lot of plants, some plants are more emotional than others. But this guy, like we have learned that this dwarf umbrella plant, if we move it to a different location, it'll start shedding leaves like crazy. And it's it's the plant's way of kind of just like, it's it's its personality. And it's just, it, 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 I won't worry too much about it. Um, as you can see, we're, we're losing leaves here too. And it's just... It could also just be natural, you know, what you really got to worry about is when like a section of the leaves just start to turn yellow instead of just like maybe one or two on the plant. The third reason that your dwarf umbrella plant's leaves are falling off or starting to droop is because you're giving the plant too much water. And this is pretty common because a lot of people find that the dwarf umbrella plant is a very thirsty plant and it likes a lot more water than like say a rubber tree, which is an example next to it. So this plant, uh, a lot of times what happens is people water it too much, which, you know, this is a thirsty plant. So it's very easy to overwater. A couple tips to see if your plant actually needs water. Bring your finger over to the pot here and dip in your finger and go about an inch or two deep. And if you feel moisture, the plant probably doesn't need to be watered. And also another tip, you can lift up the pot and kind of feel if it's waterlogged. What you have to do is kind of like start to learn the weight of each individual pot here. A lot of times we can lift up a pot of a plant and just know if it needs to be watered. Also, what you can do is look on the edge of the substrate of the of the soil here. And if you see a gap on the soil versus the pot, usually like that means that the dirt is kind of like a huge mass and it's super dried out. The fourth reason that your dwarf umbrella plant is losing leaves is because you're not watering it enough. And I know that might sound crazy because I just got done talking about not to overwater this plant, but plants, your house plants need to be somewhere in the middle. You need to water them adequately and you need to not forget to water them. So there's just somewhere in the middle because the plants, they try to tell us when they don't have enough water and when they have too much water. 
On average, people find themselves watering the dwarf umbrella plant once a week. This is a pretty thirsty plant and its root structure is actually pretty huge in comparison to a lot of other house plants. So these are very thirsty roots and a lot of times what happens is the first signs that your dwarf, your dwarf umbrella plant is needing water is the leaves start to drop and they start to fall kind of like this. I would say this plant maybe even could use some water because you see this starting to droop here a little bit. Um, it's quite often that these plants will start to tell you when they need more water. Hopefully this video helped you learn why your dwarf umbrella plant is losing leaves. Uh, there's a lot of issues with this. It is a pretty sensitive plant to moving it around in your household, so just be aware of that. And also the plant just sometimes naturally loses leaves, so don't freak out. You know, if it's one or two or three, chances are it's completely fine and the plant's just kind of absorbing the energy of those dying leaves. Um, leave a comment below if you have any questions on this plant. Like the video, subscribe to the channel because uh, we have a lot of cool projects coming. Um, we're gonna be doing repots, we're gonna be doing treating, all kinds of stuff just as eventually, I mean, essentially, this is just like our vlog log of just our houseplant journey. So please subscribe. Um, hopefully this helped you on the dwarf umbrella plant losing leaves. Guys, 